Carl E. Story. Yeah. Uh. Thank you. Thank What's you. What's up, Carl? I'm all right, T. That was hot, man. Thank you, bro. Now, I'm, I'm, I'm checking your whole get up and everything, man. I mean, that's something somebody, they have yet to do that. Where that's like the draft. Only the people, the basketball players, right, right. wear the baseball cap with the shirt and the tie. Right? Am I right? Right. Yeah. That's true. Only the, NF, you know, the NBA players and the NFL players, when they get drafted, do that. What's going on with that, though? Speak to that, me. I mean, because there's a reason why you even came on board and went live worldwide the way you are. What's the reasoning behind it? Basically, I, I'm just for like, you know, as an as a, as a artist doing this and, and knowing, you know, the responsibility of, of the art form, I'm just here to just... Uh, Try to clear up a few things that's going on. You know what I'm saying? Hold up. Did you hear what he said? The responsibility of the art form. Yeah. Now, that sounds like somebody that's taking this craft real serious, right? Yeah. I, I think so. He's to be commended for that, man. <laughs> I mean, I mean so, so you're setting an example. That's what it's all about? Yeah, it's definitely about progress. You know what I'm saying? And the music, it, it represents history. And it represents the struggle. You know what I'm saying? So for me right now, it's all about trying to see it to the next level. Is that is that a process that all artists that write their own music is that something they should consider the history of the music you know their their you know is is that, is that what they should be some of the things they should be thinking about? I Man, I, I definitely feel like it's your own opinion, but naturally when you think about the situation that how many how many lives this music actually touch, you have to actually consider what you're saying. Because, I mean, if you really want to think about it and you want to do something with what you're doing, you know, a, a lot of times people moving off music. Right. You know what I'm saying? So if my music is telling you to do this, do this and this, I mean, you do have some type of, you know what I'm saying, input. You know what I'm saying? Some type of, some type of uh, uh, in a sense, you have effect on, on things when you're saying stuff like that. So for, for me, I mean, I think all artists should challenge themselves in a way to, you know, improve themselves right. and, and others through their music. Hope is the new crack that blow up in your face just like that. And will you help out or will you hurt? Knowing something and not doing nothing is the worst. Applied knowledge is power, but first you gotta get to the knowledge that's the gift and curse to get a big day. Search for something better, especially in sleeping weather. I'm gonna let the cat out the bag. He got some interesting titles on his CD. Think topics that he's speaking to, like fatherless child. Mm -hmm. He didn't. He wasn't a fatherless child, but he took the he had the audacity to write to those individuals. You know, there's others that I'm gonna get into, like young black celebrity taking care of the little ones, huh? Mm -hmm. Don't have kids. Got a song called "Take Care of the Little Ones," right. huh? How real is that? Like I said, you know, it's, it's all about. Understanding in, in, in many ways as you can, you know, when it comes to the the parent, the parental situation, you know, parents and stuff like that in the hood, in particular. I mean, that's what I know. So in the hood, you know, in the communities, the black communities, you know, sometimes the dad's not there. A lot of cases, but I grew up with my father and my mother, and they they grounded me to be a, a understanding person. So when it comes to like my friends and stuff that didn't have that advantage to have a father, you know, like my people, you know, my mother, my father, they they kind of like in a sense, just kind of kind of came in, you know what I'm saying, and kind of was like there for them in a sense, you know what I'm saying? So when I made Fatherless Child, it was all about me and my father not seeing each other for a while and me feeling uh, kind of in a sense like wanting him to be there as I go on my journey, you know what I'm saying? And, and it was all about a, kind of an anger at first, but when I ended the, the, the writing, you know, the rap or whatnot, it was all about love and understanding that we human. And we face temptations and t situations, and, and you have to be, in a sense, you have to be considerate of that. Right. You know, of course, I'm young, so I like to have fun too, get wild, do my thing. But at the same time, it's, a, it's about balance. You know what right. I'm saying? And at least have some type of balance within yourself to realize that you can't go, can't go all the way left. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. You got to keep something. You know what I'm saying? So, what was the meaning yeah, you know what I'm saying? with the song? 
Young black, young black celebrity. Young black celebrity, it, it is what it is. Like right at, come on, coming right at you. It's that simple. I mean, you know, we dealing with a lot of people as far as uh, within the community that get successful and they become celebrities, you know what I'm saying? With the music, you know what I'm saying? You blow up, you do your thing, you know what I'm saying? And, and a young black celebrity was all about remembrance, remembering where we, where, where it was like to be in the hood, and understanding that everybody ain't balling. Now another song title, Take Care of the Little Ones. Speak, yeah. speak to that because you don't have any kids, do you? No, no kids. <laughs> no girl. Hold on, ladies. You don't have any yeah. kids. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you know. The passionate one, right. yo. Yeah. I mean, how passionate are you? You ain't got no kids, right, yo. Right. <laughs> now, I'm just messing around. <laughs> Take good. care of the little ones. No kids. You're right, right. But why come up with a song like that? What's the reasoning behind that? Take care of the little ones. That, that was a song based on a little, little bit of imagination. It's kind of like a, a story I came up with for like uh, me dating a woman that had a kid. You understand? And uh, me kind of battling or understanding how to uh, approach the kid. You know, like the first verse is, is about that. You know, trying to like... Uh, Hold on. You ain't hear nobody in a rap say nothing about nothing like that. And that happens all the time. Right. You know, stepdads, you know, step in the picture. You know, but to actually rap about those... Hope is the new crack that blow up in your face just like that. And will you help out or will you hurt? Knowing something and not doing nothing is the worst Applied knowledge is power But first, you gotta get to the knowledge That's the gift and curse To get a big day Search for something better Especially in sleeping weather If sleep is scared to death Only time laying my head down Is when I deserve the rest And that's when it's the best Watching my back, trying to pass God's test Using pain so much, need an armrest Quick to open notebooks like a locksmith Ain't no hope, we hustle and pray Just got your path on and focus on the way I'm not hoping, but hope is a word that I'm not gonna say We need more to hope to live a day Passion, bop your head like this with me uh, Bop your head like this with me I put the hands up and you got the passion I put the hands up and you got the passion I told you you got great lyrics. You know what I mean? Passionate. Passionate.